okay you know it's funny when you're driving along and you see on the map all these little spots along the way so you think oh, let's investigate a little bit further so i did and as you see coming up uh there's a trail from dub no from merlong to dubbo or dubbo merlong whichever way you're going and there's a trail that's called um oh, what's it called animals on bikes so all the farmers have created sculptures from junk or whatever with animals and bikes whichever way they thought appropriate and they put it on the side of the road and there's a marker on wiki camps so have a look it's interesting put some of the uh, photos up that i took if you are dedicated to take every photo try not to have your caravan on it's some are very hard to stop and take a photo with i did the best i could with the van on and i didn't go all the way to dubbo because uh, i turned off and went to uh had to stop off camp but um yeah they're interesting have a look just like that for the second night of my solo tour up north while Sills back in melbourne i'm at uh, pronto falls reserve throw it up it's um it's right on a river i think it's, I think it's the wellington river <laughs> i'll just double check i should have found that out before i actually said it but this is it see down there it's nice and full there's a couple a couple more campers up there it's more up there at the moment you can't well we can't collect firewood uh fire danger period too so no fires i'll have to do me meats on the barbecue so next update have fun good morning beautiful start to the day um just up on a hill or mountain called mount capita it's in the mount capita national park and where i was last night down in narrabri nice and flat and everything and as you can see behind me, I don't know if you can see too well. Moving around there. Straight up in the mountains. All flat down there. Beautiful. Just rose up out of the flats as it does. Heading north. And um, so I thought I'd show you some oh, you know, 20 million year old bits of rock work it's very nice path turns into well maintained little one well, it is well maintained anyway a few stairs and everything this is part of what we're going to see Basalt lava this is over about 20 odd million years ago. Similar to uh, what you see down in Tasmania, with the black ones on the coast there, exactly the same way they formed. Just that this is inland North New South Wales. Right, I'll keep showing you around. You can tell this is just part of, just worn away from the and the water running down through and everything. 
because you know, here you can see the tops crack pillars same shapes hexagon type cracks down here, look at this, from, close up to these, I call them organ pipes because they look like the pipe organs in the church, here's something cool, look there, Big chunks falling down. It's just weathered that way. It's look like old ruins from a real old city. Isn't nature wonderful? Look at the trees just growing out of the rocks. As they said in Jurassic Park, life finds a way. Unfortunately, what I read coming, and they said coming in the afternoon, the sun lights it up better. They were right, but just didn't have time. Heading through early in the morning, so I thought I'd just drop in and see. So if you're coming this way, try and make it in the afternoon. Would look more spectacular. Spectacular as it is. Hope you enjoyed that. Just a little tick off on your travels. It only took half hour. To walk there, do the touristy thing with the photographs and everything, walk back, that's about it, not far. I know I kept saying the organ pipes, a bit of echo under here, yes, I know I kept saying the organ pipes, uh, but it's at, as I said before, Mount Capita National Park, but they actually call them the sawn rocks, because they look like rocks that have been sawn off like the trees. There you go. Anyway, as I said before, come for a stopover, break your drive up, it takes half an hour. All good. On to the next spot. There we go. Good morning. Well, another cracker of a spot. Uh, I'm at Lee's Reserve, just out of Gundawindi, just on the other side of the border, actually in Queensland now. However, just over there, is New South Wales. So this was a good find. I was going to stay up further, look better on wiki camps and that, but it turned out to be just right off the road. Still against the river, but just right off the road. So I thought I'll come down. There's another one not far um, from here as well. Yellow Reserve or something like that. That was a bit iffy getting in. Probably be all right, but I uh, just came down here further and to Lee's which I'm glad I did because this down from as you saw I was walking down the hill this is the camp spot well not actually the camp spot but like a parking bit it's soft there's you go up there if you've got camper trailers or something but there's low uh, tree branches and things like that over there so no good for the caravans if you really want you to park in here but there's no solar but it is soft as you can see but the um look at this it's a nice spot for the the kids to go in i'm sure it's a um, local swimming spot well actually last night when i pulled in i guess they are though there were some people here they left and some other families came in with their kids. They were just having a bit of a splash around. That was uh, that was Sunday night, so we'll see what happens. During the week, hopefully it'll be a lot quieter. And as now, I have it to myself. But as you can see, look at this. Beautiful. It's not that strong in there. I went for a swim yesterday. It's fairly shallow.
and I go again this afternoon as well. Apparently the fishing is top spot here if you're into river fishing. So when I was in there there was a couple of fish splashed out probably I don't know about 10 15 meters away from me. So they're there and those little um, oh, I forget what they're called they're like like prawns the clear sort of freshwater prawn type things with long nippers. Yeah, if you stay still too long they'll come and nibble at your toes. This is a good spot. I think I'll stay here for a couple of days. Yes. Catch you later.